Hello everyone. Today we are making perfect dosa batter for rice batter pancakes. For that we need 1 cup raw rice, 1 cup or you can make it to half cup urad dal which is a black gram and a half a tablespoon of fenugreek seeds and half cup of rice flakes. Rinse the rice and urad dal separately and soak them separately in a bowl for about 4 to 6 hours for the rice flakes and fenugreek seeds you can just soak for 20 minutes before blending the paste make sure you use enough water to cover them and soak them after that drain the water from the soaked ingredients in a batches grind the soaked raw rice separately or initially until it turns to a smooth or a bit coarsely batter and the urad dal separately but the urad dal should be smooth enough in texture while grinding the urad dal just at the final stage or the final rotation use the soaked rice flakes and fenugreek seeds just grind for 2 minutes and then take out the batter into a big bowl or a serving bowl make sure the consistency should be thick but smooth enough combine all the ground ingredients in a mixing bowl and add a salt to taste and mix well and then let it go for fermentation by covering the bowl with a lid and keeping that in a warm place for at least 8 hours or overnight during the fermentation the batter will rise and become slightly airy and will form air pockets in between them You can make 10 number of dosa varieties with this batter, not just the pancake. After the fermentation, gently mix the batter using a ladle. If the batter is too thick, add a little water to get the desired consistency. Now we are going to make the pancakes. Heat a non-stick or cast iron skillet over medium heat. Once it becomes hot, then pour a ladle full of batter in the center or at the side and spread it in a circular motion to form a thin pancake. Or you can make 2-3 to three pancakes if your skillet is larger one. Then drizzle a little oil around the edges of the pancake and cook until the edges start to lift and the bottom turns golden brown now flip the pancake and cook the other side for a short duration then remove from the pan once both sides are golden brown and crispy Serve the pancakes hot with your favorite chutney or sambar or with your favorite dipping sauce. Please try the recipe at home and leave a comment how it turned out. Please do like, share and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Happy cooking. Namaste.